What's going on guys? It's your boy, Tom Talk Rubbish, and today I'm back with an impromptu video. The, just to let you know, there's going to be no fancy editing in this video, uh, because my boy, Tyler, who, from Last Fan Standing, if you haven't checked those guys out, please make sure you go share and uh, subscribe to them, um, is busy, so, and I felt like this video couldn't wait. So there's going to be no fancy thumbnail, no fancy intro, which, cheers for that, by the way, sir. But, I, obviously, it was reported in the last hour at time of recording that Bray Wyatt was released by WWE. Um, by, it was reported first by Sean Rossap of Fightful. Go check them out if you haven't. And I just wanted to give you my thoughts on it. And basically, I'm like, why? What's the point? Like, you have someone who took the a bad gimmick, in my opinion, of Husky Harris, turned that into Bray Wyatt, uh, Swamp Bray Wyatt, and and then which later would become like Sister Abigail Bray Wyatt, which wasn't as good but still creative, which would ultimately turn into the Fiend, which would also give us the Fire Fire Funhouse match. Uh, and bits like that. So I do not understand how someone as creative as Bray Wyatt has was released by WWE when no when the yeah it, this is how shocked I am. I can't get my words out, guys. Um, a creative mind like that was released, but when essentially uh, the business of wrestling is about being creative. And stuff like that. So, in my opinion, I think WWE dropped the ball. But it will be someone else's game. Like, I'm trying to think where I'd like to see Bray Wyatt go. Maybe Impact. Yeah, actually, probably Impact. Credit to Louis Dangle of Give Me Sports on this one. But I saw, because, like he said, AW is a more... Um, Sports and reality based program, whereas Impact has killed pe killed people off, for example, or had a like more soap opera storylines. I feel like Bray Wyatt would fit in there more. So yeah, overall, guys, this is just a little three minute video to say thank you for the memories, Bray Wyatt. Like you, he's not died, so I don't know why I'm saying that, but like Bray Wyatt is gone, and I can't wait to see what. I know his last name is Rotunda, but the the man behind him does next. So yeah, overall guys, a shocking release in my opinion. Don't see why, and don't really understand why, but, and I know it was down to budget cuts according to the internet, but I don't really understand why. It's a big loss for WWE, and like, as I say, I'm excited to see what he does next. If you like this video, even though it was a rambling mess, please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, bye.